Now let's talk about those output tabs in a little bit more detail, specifically our print, help, and web tab. And remember that this corresponds to our output checkboxes here, which govern whether that object actually publishes to that output. So if we have an object that is allowed to publish to our print output, then when that object publishes to print, which would be Microsoft Word or PDF, then all of the properties inside of this print tab are then applied to that object when it's being published. Right now we're looking at a topic object. A topic object has its own unique set of properties for its print tab. Uh, the, the print tab properties in, say, a table of contents object would be different from this one here. Um, but what we're saying here is that this heading will be assigned to this topic when it's published to a print output. It's going to start a new chapter. It will insert a section break. And it will use the media object chapter section for its page layout. All right. Now, if you have a topic that is allowed to publish to a help output, then when it is published to one of our help formats, then all of the properties in the help tab are what get applied to that topic when it is published to that help format. All right. You can see these properties are different from what we saw in the print tab because help uh, formats have their own unique characteristics associated with them. All right. For example, down here below, you can associate context strings, context IDs with help topics because they may be associated with context-sensitive help, which would not make sense for a print output that you would just view in, say, Word or PDF. So here's everything that that topic needs in order to publish to a help output. And similarly, the web tab gives you everything that the object needs to publish to HTML, XHTML, and so on. All right, so what we essentially have here is one object. That one object is equipped to publish to all of the different output formats. Because what we've done is categorize all of our different output formats to either be print, help, or web. And then those properties associated with that output format are then located inside of the print, help, and web tabs 